Hello my beauties and welcome back to another vlog. Hi, my name is Janelle if you're new and if you're not, hey, my name is still Janelle, thanks for being here. So, it's Monday, it is 2.35, I am about to film my July TBR video. Um, and then later tonight, me and Jonathan are going bowling for a youth event. Um, I don't know if I'm going to vlog too much of that just because I can't film the kids without getting their parents' permission. So if I can get some footage without the kids in it, will be golden. If not, oh well. As far as my current read, I am currently reading From Blood and Ash by Jennifer L. Armentrout. I am on page 108. And I am really, really enjoying this book. However, it is definitely a chunker, so it's taking some serious motivation to read this. <laughs> yeah, um, I don't know if there's anything too exciting happening this week. I am only gonna be vlogging today, maybe tomorrow, definitely Wednesday, maybe Thursday. Um, because Summerween starts on Friday and I'm gonna be doing a whole separate vlog for that. So this vlog is kind of gonna be in some weird days. Um, so hopefully, some entertaining stuff happens that will entertain you. Um, I am going to film my video as soon as my camera battery is done charging. It's charging over here. Um, it shouldn't take too long, um, but until then, I'm going to just read some of From Blood and Ash because it's raining outside and it's really, really cozy. And I kind of just want to have a cozy time with a book. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get to reading. And if you want, you can grab your book and you can read for the whole 30 seconds of this music and shots. Oh yeah, so if you guys like vlogs and you like book content, you should subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate it. I do vlogs every single week and it you guys seem to really, really like my vlogs. I feel like my vlogs get more views than like most things on my channel. Um, and if you guys wanna see more vlogs, just let me know. Let me know in the comments. I will totally vlog more if that is what you're wanting to see. If you're wanting to see something completely different, please comment down below and I could try and work it out. Um, but yeah, please subscribe. I would really, really appreciate it. It's super easy. It's big and red. It says subscribe on it. If it's still red, you didn't click it. If it turns gray, you clicked it. Good job. Love you so much. Okay, so just got done, <laughs> just got done filming um, my July TBR video. Super fun, really excited with all of the choices that I have for this month. But me and Jonathan are about to leave to go to the bowling event. Um, but before that, I wanted to play the TBR game with Jonathan so that he could have like his own little mini TBR for the month. Um, so we've decided we're gonna do two spins for him. So hopefully he doesn't get out of spin. Um, he's in the middle of a book right now. So we're gonna do, why don't you stretch yourself? Try three, just do three. I read very slowly and my reading comprehension is He like, doesn't read super slowly and his reading comprehension isn't bad. It's that he doesn't sit down to read as often as I sit down to read. I have read. other hobbies. I like to draw I know. and make music. I know, it's I know. It's just a lot. Okay, so then do you want to do two? two? Two's perfect. Okay, so we're going to do two. I'll come back. Well, I'll probably pop in and out um, as we're doing the spins, Um, but... We're going to do the first spin. Okay, so Jonathan's first <laughs> spin, he got any. So he literally gets to pick any book he wants. It really doesn't help me narrow this down. No, it really doesn't. All right. All right, I pick 
Project Hail Mary by Andy Weir. Basically, from what I was reading, it's about this guy who wakes up in a ship who doesn't really even remember his name or what's going on. His crewmates are dead and he has to finish this mission or else Earth will perish. And so basically he's just trying to get a grip of everything and having to save the whole entire world. Uh, yeah. Sounds I like sci-fi. I like sci-fi uh, and space, space. Yeah. a lot. Um, but I don't like staying in one area, and this might be a book where it just stays in one place the whole time. But we'll, we'll see. see. We'll see. All right, yeah. second spin. Okay, so Jonathan's next prompt is takes place in a different country. So he's trying to find a book that takes place in a different country. Oh, okay, please tell me this takes. This looks like they're British. Come on. <laughs> uh, my second pick is Children of Blood and Bone, which apparently takes its modeled after Venice, Venice. Italy. So that means it's not probably a literal Venice, Italy, but yeah. Uh, yeah, I picked this one. This is basically about a girl who lives a life where she remembered when magic was around, but it has disappeared. Um, and people hunt down, hunted down magic people and killed them. So her mom's dead or her parents, I don't really know. And then she basically takes down the evil people and uses magic stuff with people magic okay so we actually are leaving now um to go to the bowling alley um it's gonna be really fun i'm really excited i think i'm going to bring i was gonna bring a book with me just in case i probably will just in case um jonathan's telling me no never mind i'm not gonna bring a book guys <laughs> um you been, you're a leader <laughs> I'm gonna kind of... bring a book. Wait. Anyways, I'm gonna go get some shoes on and we're gonna go to the bowling alley. Good morning, beauties. So it is now Tuesday. It is 8.34. Um, I know I'm up kind of early, right? I know it's a whole, I'm a whole new person today. This morning, I have a little bit of time before I go to work. I have to leave around 10.30. Um, so it, I have like two hours-ish uh, to myself and I'm really, really excited about it. It's gonna be so refreshing hopefully. But my plan this morning is to do some budgeting for the month of July in my planner that I have. I haven't done any of the budgeting for the month of July yet. And I think we have like two days left of July. So I need to get on it. And I also need to finish doing my bullet journal for the month of July. I didn't do a spread for June. So it's kind of weird, like just going from May to July. Still reading from Blood and Ash. And I am now on page 166 so i've made a little bit of progress i think since we've chatted i read some last night um i do want to read some still this morning i just don't know if i'm going to be able to get to it once i'm done budgeting and doing my journal so it really just depends if i get to this that's pretty much everything but i'm going to get into budgeting and journaling
Okay, so I did some budgeting and it was in my journal. And as you guys saw, I took a spontaneous trip to Barnes and Noble um, because why not? Um, I didn't get anything. I just kind of wanted to go look around and just browse some books before I had to be at work. Um, but I have to walk into work in like three minutes. But yeah, I just wanted to pop in here and say that I'm going to work so that it didn't just cut off, I guess. I don't know. Um, but yeah, so I am going to go into work and then I will most likely see you guys later. Good morning, so it's Wednesday, it's currently 11.09. Um, we slept in way later than I really, both of us really wanted to. But we're having to accept that that's the day and move on with it. Um, we are currently at the grocery store. Um, we are about to go grocery shop. That's the plan. Okay, so please disregard my hair. It looks bad, really, no matter what I do. I look like a freaking lion. That's as good as it's getting. Me and Jonathan went grocery shopping. I apologize that there isn't more footage of it. We were just, grocery shopping just stresses me out. So I'm just, ugh. Yeah, uh, now we are at the church because Jonathan had to be here early before youth starts to like set things up and just do some work. I'm sitting here and I'm planning on reading more of From Blood and Ash by Jennifer L. Armentrout. I am on page 176 um, and I'm really, really hoping that I can finish this like tomorrow, hopefully, um, because tomorrow is July 1st and I have like 10 books on my TBR this month and I need to hit all of them. So I am going to be really busy with reading, I feel like. So I just kind of want to get all of them read pretty quickly um, and then maybe have like a room for mood reading at the end of the month. So I just need to get this book read like really, really badly. So I'm going to try and sit here because youth doesn't start for like another four hours. I mean, we have our huddle in like three hours. So I feel like in three hours, I could do some damage to this book for sure. So I'm literally going to read for the next three hours. Oh, and I'm also going to be eating some veggie chips because why not, you know? Um, and I'm going to drink some water too because water is important. So let's get to reading. <music> Well, good morning. It is now Thursday and it's 9.34. Um, I woke up around eight, but it took me forever to get out of bed. And then I ate breakfast and, you know, did the morning stuff. So I'm just now getting some time to sit down and vlog and sit down and read. Still reading from Blood and Ash. Uh, yesterday I got to page 402. So I have about 200-ish pages left of this. And I'm really, really hoping to finish it today because first of all, today is the last day of this vlog because tomorrow is the start of Summerween. So I'm gonna be doing a Summerween vlog. But yeah, so I do wanna get this done. I don't think it's gonna take me long to get through the last 200 pages because it's getting so good. I mean, it's been good since I started, but now it's like, okay, like we gotta keep going. Yeah, I, I'm really, really excited. So I'm hoping I can get Quite a bit of reading done this morning. I have about an hour to read. Um, so I'm hoping to at least read like 50-ish pages. Um, and then um, and then after work, 
I'll probably bring this to work in case I have any moments where I can read. Um, but if not, then after work, I'm just gonna knock this out really quick because I also have a video to edit. I'm gonna shut up now and I'm going to read, wow. I'm gonna read as much as I can of this lovely, lovely book right here. back from work um it's currently 5 54 um jonathan has left to go to worship practice and i'm currently sitting down and i am planning i'm getting like detail stuff together um for my sister-in-law's gender reveal um i can finally say this like out loud on camera but my sister-in-law is having a baby and i am so so excited for her um, but she has asked me to plan it and i feel so honored i literally feel like a queen um so i'm gonna use that to make her feel like a queen yeah so i've just been doing like a lot of stuff just figuring out what we need to buy just ideas that i have for things and um an invite list so that's what i've been doing update on from blood and ash i am currently on page 510 so i have like 100 pages left of this and i'm determined to finish it before before i took dinner so i'm planning on Finishing this, cooking dinner, and then me and Jonathan are starting our readathon tonight. So this will be the end of the vlog, um, but I want to finish this for the vlog. So I'm going to now read for a little bit and then I'll be right back. Okay, editing Janelle here. And I've just realized that I either didn't film an ending clip or I deleted it. I don't know. Um, but I'm just here to say that I did finish from Blood and Ash and I absolutely loved it. I can't decide if I'm four and a half or five stars. Like I really, I think I'm five stars, honestly, because it was so good, so well written. I mean, I was just like, I didn't expect to like it that much. And I think it's because I'd heard so many mixed things like, oh, it has a slow start. Oh, it's kind of boring. Oh, it's not really my thing. And I just like kind of took that and I was like, oh, then I probably won't like it. I ended up loving it and it was so good. But I did want to pop in here and say that. Um, but if you have made it to this point, thank you. Thank you so much for watching the whole vlog. It means so, so much to me. And if you've made it this far and you aren't subscribed, make sure to do that. It would make me ooper duper super happy. So I will see you guys in my next video.